Hey, what's up, y'all? It's uh, week seven, going into week seven. Uh, Pittsburgh coming off straight off the win against Kansas City. Um, got the Cincinnati Bengals coming into Heinz Field uh, for a AFC North matchup. Um, if you've watched my videos over the years, you know where I stand when it comes to the Cincinnati Bengals. Uh, you're in, you're out. Come on here and make these hate weeks for the for the Bengals. Um, and when you win so much, over and over and over, uh, it really is hard sometimes to come up with new things to say. Uh, because over the last what four or three or four years, I've spit every fact of this complete non-achieving, non-hardware bringing home garbage franchise, the Cincinnati Bengals. Um, we got them coming in the Heinz Field, man. Um, and I've already heard from a lot of you fools, you Cincinnati fans, that you guys are going to sweep us this year. I, I just find it hard to believe that you're gonna sweep us, bro. I mean, for Christ's sakes, we've been playing you motherfuckers for 50 years. 50 fucking years. And you all have swept us twice. Two times. That's just a stupid fucking comment. Um, we know the past, we know the history. We own these bitches. We own you, Cincinnati. Face it, we own you. Anytime there's a big matchup, important game, we beat you, okay? And we beat you because of your fucking ignorant coach. And it has just a, you know, just ignorant, man. Uh, how this guy, Marvin Lewis, has a job is beyond me. Uh, this dude has done nothing. He's won a bunch of regular season football games. Zero and seven in the playoffs. Still the hot, still hot garbage. But I hope y'all keep him for another decade. Uh, I love it. Um, yeah, I mean, w when I first started making videos in this bitch, uh, there was quite a few Bengal fans. Uh, and then year by year by year by year, they completely disappear. Um, I have a lot of respect for A Train, as you know. Um, and it's sad that A Train comes on here and makes videos here and there uh, and still has to stand up for the Bengals because nobody else will. I got a lot of respect for A-Train for that. Um, you know, we got a couple of Bengal video makers in here that are just retarded. I wouldn't even waste my time with, man, seriously. Um, but none of that matters, like I said, come this Sunday. Uh, this Sunday we have the Bengals coming into Heinz Field. Um, I've heard a lot, you know, the only thing I've heard all week, uh, also from you Bengal fans, other than, other than the fact that y'all said y'all were going to sweep us this year, I've heard how this is a new, new Bengals team, and we better watch out because of your, the offensive coordinator or whatever. Um, you guys have, have ran through coordinators and players over the years, and we beat you with whoever you got. So it really don't matter. Your fucking offensive coordinator or whatever the fuck uh, shit y'all got planned for Sunday that you think is going to happen ain't going to happen. Uh, we all know what happens to Andy Dalton when you get pressure on Andy Dalton, and that's what's going to happen Sunday. Uh, we're going to get some pressure on Andy Dalton. Um, we just we going to we going to force some turnovers. We're going to get some sacks like we always do with Andy Dalton. Um, you know you do got AJ Green. Uh, you know we'll have to see about your running back. Uh, Burfick's always out there, uh, so you know you got to watch for the extra play from Burfick. Uh, offensively, I'd put same as last week. Run the ball. Run the ball. Run the ball, pass. That's my. But I got you. Got to put. I would love to see the Steelers mix in some more James Conner with uh, Le'Veon Bell, please. Coach Tomlin, Ty Haley, could we please do that? Uh, Le'Veon, you know, can't get all the work all the time. 
Um, but yeah, man, that that's that's the formula to win this game, pretty much the same as last week. Um, but I just want want you Bengal fans, anybody, you ain't got to be in the TTC, anywhere on YouTube, would you please fuckers tell me what the fuck I'm supposed to be concerned about? Would you give me one motherfucking reason why I should be concerned about the Bengals? Hmm? Because of late, we've just fucking straight up owned you bitches. Owned you bitches. And I, I don't have a reason to think or have any doubt of why it won't continue. I just don't. And it ain't going to continue. Because come this Sunday, you're going to get handled. Okay? Pittsburgh's not losing two games in a row at Heinz Field. It ain't happening. Okay? They'll be ready for this one. Um... Y'all can talk all that noise that you want. You bitches are two and three. Uh, you couldn't even score against the Ravens. I mean, dude, really, what the fuck am I supposed to be worried about when it comes to the Cincinnati Bengals? There's nothing that I'm worried about other than kicking your ass come Sunday when you go back down to that shithole, dumbass city of Cincinnati, losers, once again. Um... Yeah, I mean, there's not really a lot to talk about. Like I said, ain't nobody I like in here making bingo videos worth me even fucking watching. Um, but it just amazes me, man, because these fans, these Cincinnati fans, I talk, I talk about it year in and year out. Um, you know, it, it's the same thing with them, dude. It's the th same thing. They talk a lot of shit, but never back it the fuck up. And at the end of the day, they look stupid as always. Uh, that's why their trophy case is goddamn near empty. They got two fucking AFC champion trophies in that bitch. That's it. In 50 fucking years, you would have think you would have accomplished something. But y'all bitches ain't ac accomplished anything. Um, you're the only fucking team in this fucking division without any kind of championship. Um, so, yeah. It is what it is. Please tell me why I should be worried, scared, etc. Because there's no reason for me to be scared. Or worried about the Cincinnati Bengals. Um, but like I said, I, I could make this go on and on and on and on in this video about shit. But I, I've, for the past few years, I've spent so much time uh, bashing the Bengals. Uh, and it's just too easy. Uh, you know, just too easy. Uh, and I don't see why Pittsburgh don't roll over the Bengals uh, come this Sunday. I really do think it's going to happen. Uh, and I would, I definitely think, with everything that's happened this week, we'll see uh, Martavis Bryant get a little more action. Um, Juju Smith-Schuster's playing great ball as well. We already know what AB does. Um, and I look for this offense to continue to improve. And uh, what a great week it would do, be able to do it at home against these bitches from Cincinnati. It, it would be great to send these motherfuckers back down to reality because that is what we are to the Bengals. We are the Cincinnati Bengals and the Kansas City Chiefs, Indianapolis Colts, and other teams. We are their fucking reality check. When they talk all that noise and start talking about they're going to do this and do that, we shut them down. And that's what's going to happen Sunday. We're going to shut these bitches down. Uh, and they'll be two and four, you know, you motherfuckers are hypocrites. I remember y'all were sitting at 0-3 talking about how the season was over. You win two games in a row and you motherfuckers are going to win the division. To, like I said, come this Sunday, reality check, 4.30. We're going to sit you bitches down. Uh, we are your daddy. So we're going to sit you bitches down. And y'all going to get punished, man. It is what it is. Um, Steelers all day, we roll. Um, it is what it is. We're going to run with Le'Veon. We're going to throw when we want to. We're going to bring the pressure on the quarterback. We're going to shut down the run. We're going to do what we do. And we can be sitting at 5-2, and two, and you bitches will be sitting down there at 2-4. and four. That's what's up, and that's what's going to happen. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, shout out to my tag team partner, MacMan70. Uh, Steel Maiden. Steel Jedi. The Renegade 412. Steel Twins. Uh, and stiller fans everywhere. Shout out to you guys. Let's go handle these bitches and be sitting at five and two. Uh, let's take it one game at a time. There's all kinds of hate my way for the Bengals. 
Fuck all you bitches that like the Bengals. Fuck you. Um, it don't matter who you are. Big Jimmy, fuck you too this week, bro. I mean, fuck all y'all. It is what it is. It's, it's a rivalry to y'all. But to us, it's just another winnable game that we will win and continue the dominance the dominance that the Pittsburgh Steelers have on the Cincinnati Bengals. Uh, but I don't have much here. I'm out. Y'all guys take care of each other. I'll be back Sunday uh, to talk to you guys after the game. As always, go Steelers. East up. I'm out.